What's up, chat? How's everyone doing? Surprise stream today. You probably didn't think it was coming, did you? Well, that's to be understood. Or that's understandable, I should say. But hey, guess what? I managed to finish up pretty much the bulk of my Far Cry 3 uh, editing, so... Figured why not throw in a stream. Yeah, that, that's right. Worked all day and now working all night. Why Dante? Desider, how you guys doing? Oh, that's some hot tea. It actually burned a little bit. <clears throat> Anyways, how's everyone doing? Ugh, if you didn't hear when you first clocked in, you know, clocked in, like you're going to a job, logged into the, to the channel, uh, the Far Cry 3 video is pretty much done. I'm just waiting for Rune to send me the intro. Well, that and I gotta, I gotta, well, I still have to figure out what I'm gonna put for the vote, but those are the only two things left to do. Did I finish it? Yeah, I just stated. I just have to plug in the intro when Rune finishes that, and then I have to come up with a vote for what's going to be the next... Yo, know, whichever one will be the next video. <clears throat> for some reason, my voice is really tired today. You fucking love me? Well, same that. You say that every time, Joe. But I appreciate it. Thank you. Megatron leader? Eh, I, I'm more of a star scream. Hmm. Uh, it, I'm, I'm actually, like, debating if I should put FF12 up for vote, even though I don't really feel like doing another big video. But it would fit nicely into my schedule. I got three weeks uh, until Last of Us 2 comes out, and so I could fit in one big uh, video game into the, into the slot instead of just one that would take two weeks and I'd do nothing for a week. Sorry if you haven't been commenting on streams, but you've been working on reviews. Hey, man, I don't expect anyone to put their work above, you know, watching a live stream. You do what you have to do. Don't you worry about it. You're not that invested in FF12, you suppose? Hey, <laughs> that makes two of us. But no one should ever feel like they have to, like, oh, offer me an apology because I haven't been showing up to streams or commenting. That's, that's not what this is about. You show up when you show up. You engage when you want to engage. That's all there is to it. <clears throat> Alright, let me send out the Discord announcement real quick before I forget about it. This is your first time watching my stream. Love your game, sincerely. Well, thank you, Trollface. And welcome to the stream. People will start mooing at you very shortly. Don't get too weirded out by it. That's, that's normal around these parts. But I hope you enjoy this, the, 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 the mediocre stream you're about to see. You know, I, I've... <laughs> it's, it's mainly because the game is, you know, a little... A little on the on, under-season side. Let me also say it publishes YouTube video. Send out the call. I'm in a goofy mood tonight, chat. I've been, like, seriously nose down in my video editor for, like, the past two days. I, I, I really need to be a, just a clown right now. I just, I, just, I just need to honk my horn, like, gong, gong, and just t get smacked in the face with pies. That's how you recover. I've been in monotone darting in YouTuber mode too long. Sometimes it starts to worry me. Gilroy, you're finally up and running. Have you had technical issues? Single player MMO, let's go. Been a minute? What have you missed? Uh, more Final Fantasy disguised as Star Wars. If you've seen Star Wars, you can probably guess. You're about to kill off in a character in your book, and you want to cry, hey, at least you you're, you got the balls to kill off your babies. That's, that's a sign of a, yo, good writing. Well, possibly. Not like I've read the book. Hmm. <clears throat> Hope everyone's brought their tea, because I'm sipping it like mad right now. I'm going to like, have another cup before I even start playing. Well, specifically when I said Star Wars, I meant, you know, the original trilogy, not, you know, The Last Jedi. This, this game came out well before that. Honestly, Last Jedi might make a better video game plot than a movie plot, when you think about it. Cup of tea? Yeah, we drink tea here on this stream. Tea stream. Hmm. 
Specifically, green tea. The healthiest tea. <clears throat> I cannot get my voice settled properly. You actually said that stuff earlier as an opening sin idea? This is the safest and thus most forgettable FF game so far. One that's competent, but left so little impact that the only thing we seem to remember are the bunny a girl's ass and the fact that the leads is basically a walking piece of Melba toast. That, that's also kind of the idea I was going for, I'm was going i going for. I, though the way I was thinking of it is like, it's kind of hard to forget something that has a number in it because you just you count up to it and you'll eventually reach it. But everyone just kind of like, oh, 1, 7, 8, 9, 10, 13. <laughs> this is the way I was kind of thinking of the joke. Though, it's, it's still kind of a half-formed idea. Alright, let me just click on... Okay, the YouTube video is up, so I don't need that anymore. I can switch off to that. Bring up the video, the game. Don't worry, for those wondering if we're going to play more Wonderful 101, we'll be playing some more of that soon. A good joke so far, nonetheless. Yeah. I, I just had this idea that this is like the one, even though it's got a number in it, you're, you'll just subconsciously skip over it. It's like, oh wait, wasn't there supposed to be something there? So that, that one will take some work though. I got, it's only like a half-formed idea for a sin. I got, I got like notes. It's in there. What's up, Kalkaho? Kalho? I'm afraid to say this. Kakaholes. There we go. That'll do for you. How far did we get into 101? Uh, after, the fir after the statue mission where you're falling from the sky? We stopped after that. <sighs> Chad, I feel like making myself something good as a treat tomorrow. Uh, I'm debating whether it should be like steak, or you know, steak and maybe some hash browns with it, or maybe just a you know, some something like salmon. I'm not sure. Kurosaki, uh, four month streak man. Thank you. Look at those those beautiful cows. That's a weird thing to say. Look at those beautiful cows. Anyways, uh, yeah, let's play this game most of you have never played, never will play, and probably just like sleeping your way through watching me play it. What's with the pigeons in the background of the thumbnail? Uh, well, I, I tend to have a running joke in games. If I see birds, I immediately try to kill them just, just to see if the game has death animations for the birds. I, kinda, I should actually get new Twitch art for the page eventually, because that's kind of old. Like, a lot of uh, that Twitch, you know, my, both my offline page, I mean, my offline image, and that banner. Kind of old. I need something new. I just have, you know, a bit of lack of, you know, time and, you know, ideas of what it should be. But yeah, you'll see me go nuts and try to kill every bird in a game, usually. That's the main idea of that one. Favorite TV show? I think it's probably X-Files. I really enjoyed watching that as a kid. Well, the first couple of seasons, anyways. But then again, I used to watch Simpsons religiously, too, as a kid. I kind of feel like a mo any show I really liked was one I watched as a kid, not anything more recent. All right, so let me start the recording. We good. Wait, are we good? Are you gonna, are you gonna work? Okay, there it goes. It's recording now. Alright, what's my favorite FF and favorite FF battle system? Well, my favorite overall Final Fantasy game is FF9. And favorite battle system? Hmm, well, it's gonna sound weird, but right now it's kind of a tie between 10-2 and 7 Remake. I really, even though 10-2 is kind of like a eh kind of game, it actually has a really good turn-based combat system. And it's, you know, it's actually the one that uses the job system where I really like. And 12 just kind of knocked it out of the park by finally actually managing to do, you know, real-time combat and kind of mix it in with the turn-based stuff really well. So those are my answers. Really, there's, there's only, it's only recently they've started changing their combat systems up a lot. Before that, it was just, you know, the stat system that was different. What did I think of Ro uh, Robert Patrick joined the X-Files? Hmm. I don't really know if I had any thoughts on that, to be honest. That, that was, like I said, I only really liked the first couple seasons of X-Files. After that, it kind of, like, gets wobbly. Not so good. And I didn't like anything they've done, you know, more recently with it. Like, that, it, they, it did come back for a little while, but it wasn't really for me. X2 uses jobs well. He's also just really speedy. 
All right, so we should start playing a video game, shouldn't we? So we, after, the last thing we did la uh, on the last stream was we killed the demon wall, and then we stopped. So this is my most recent stream. We'll go there. Also, shit, I forgot. I got to turn on the actual volume so you guys can hear what the hell is happening. Ah, hold up. There we go. What's up, Graham? How you doing? How would I describe X-Files as someone who hasn't seen the show? Uh, conspiracy theories. Uh, have you noticed a trend that I really like games about, cons or, you know, entertainment about conspiracies? Like, I, I, Deus Ex is among my favorite games of all time. Uh, you know, X-Files is one of my favorite TV shows. You could probably, you know, take a guess at some of the stuff I like based on those two, those two hints alone. Now yeah, we came back out to save. Now we gotta go back in. Hmm. X Files with Scooby Doo. You know that'd be a decent crossover. Is it just me, or do the Ninja Turtles get included with everything these days? Based on those titles, I see you like hentai. Pardon? Uh, sure, go with that. I, I can be convinced that maybe hentai is worth the time. Maybe it's really good. Maybe I'll enjoy it. Who knows? It might. There, there's gotta be something out there I'll enjoy of it. Yo, know, I've stopped playing this game for one day and I immediately forgot what was I doing. What's my favorite boss fight in a game and why? Oof. All the questions tonight. Favorite boss fight in the game? I really just enjoyed the monsoon boss fight in Metal Gear Rising. I thought that was like almost the perfect boss fight. Just because the the combat system worked really well and the boss was designed well. I hope that's you know the proper answer and you weren't expecting something more deep. Sometimes, sometimes when I get asked a question, people think I'm not like really intelligent when I gotta remind everyone that I'm actually a dumbass and my tastes are actually really shit. What are some good movies to rethink? Uh, movies to rethink your entire life? I don't think there are any. Not that I've seen, anyways. There's been no movie I've ever watched like, wow, man, that's deep. Guess I gotta think things through again. No, I, I can't help you there. What's my favorite question to be asked, and how many times should we ask it? Uh, I don't... You're just being facetious. I get you there. I don't know, I, 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 I don't really mind asking, being answer, answering questions, I mean... Chat's usually pretty good with them. Except when they do the troll questions. Uh, you need to look up clips from Metal Gear Solid Rising. Yeah, sadly that, that video, that stream is was well before the archive channel was started. So you can't really watch it. There's probably clips from it, though. I don't know if there's any clips from that specific fight, though. So you, what's up, Jim? How you doing? Hmm. This next game I do might be the last older game I do for a while, because after that, we got three weeks until all the new games start up again. Then I'm going to be busy probably for the rest of the year, actually. Seems like it just spaced out really well. There are ones from the Armstrong fight? Yeah, I'd imagine so. My reaction to the MAGA line was, you know, priceless. Me, what? Me streaming what? Really loudly? And probably blowing my microphone? Out. I, sh I need to put, uh, quickly put the word out after that, otherwise it sounds wrong. How's my cat? Uh, she did that thing where she wants to play with me, then scratch really hard earlier today, so I guess she's fine. That's usually a good sign of a cat's health. 
Or at least I've been told by experts. Any plans with Ghost of Tsushima? My plan is to play it and do a video on it. Does that suffice? In fact, that that kind of comes out two weeks after. Uh, well, two or three weeks after The Last of Us 2, so it kind of works perfectly in my schedule. It's because as soon as I finish with Last of Us 2 in that video, I can immediately move on to that. Dex sounds abusive. Dex is a cat. Every cat is basically an abusive husband wearing a wife beater. They just look they just look a, a bit cuter. A, a cat would definitely issue the argument, look what you make me do! That's that's a cat for you. And, we, and we're like all the abused girlfriends con constantly coming back. I'm sorry, baby. I won't do it again. What am I attacking? This is like a a trash can with a face. Also. Cats are unfortunately too adorable for their own good. You know, they lucked out on that evolutionary thing. They, had they been like, you know, really, un you know, ooh, fucking, oof, oof, mate. Had, had they not been that on the cuter side of the evolutionary spectrum, they, they would not be among our, among our people. Your own cat just tried to jump on you while you were lying on your side. Yeah, they'll do that. Mm. But you always end up forgiving them, don't you? It's like, oh, you didn't mean to. When they just look at you and then lick the fresh blood off their claw. What isn't on the cute side of the, the evolutionary spectrum? Many things. Have, have you ever seen, like, a, a mungfish? Or, what, what is it, a slime fish? I, I, I forget what they're called, but they're basically like a fish that does nothing but excrete mucus and they look like melted candle wax. Wish I could use my magic from a menu really quickly. Blomfish, yes. They even got a name like that. Then you have, yo, in, n look at any anglerfish. In fact, most sea creatures are not going to be on the cute index. Then you have naked mole rats. I don't think people are going to find those too cute. Hmm. Parrotfish? Okay, I'll give you that one. Mainly because they get the big front teeth, don't they? Is that the one I'm thinking of? Yeah, there are fish that are cute, but a lot of them are not. There's definitely fewer of them on the cute scale. And what's more, most of them aren't even cute when they're little. It's like, almost every land animal will be cute when it's young. Fish, sometimes it's just, no, you're, you're still ugly. Sorry. I'm gonna fry you in olive oil hot later on. Zomb zombie. Oh, okay, we can just kill them very quickly with a bunch of white magic. Or what about clownfish? I said some fish are cute, but the majority of them are not. Majority of them are the, are there just to made to be tasty once they've been cut apart, or so that's what all my Asian friends tell me. New System Shock remake demo came out on Steam and GOG. Really? God. Maybe they stopped working on demos for that game and actually worked on the game. They might one day finish it. I mean, I appreciate that they're releasing so many demos for it, but Jesus Christ, that game's been in development for hell for four years now. You're really into our cute fish chat? Mm. Kawaii fish. Hmm. 
sharks are adorable. Uh, which ones? I've always found hammerhead sharks to be kind of like, okay, that's a little bit on the cute side. I don't mind being eaten by that. Especially since it can't actually bite me, eat me since his mouth is too small. Have you ever seen the shark that can literally shoot its jaws at you? Like, it's like a fucking alien. It can just shoot its jaws of, about a few meters or like a few feet out from it and just grab something and then you pull it back in. What about lizards? There's plenty of cute lizards out there. Goblin shark. It's even got the perfect name for it. Though I would have preferred Xenomorph. Of course you've seen Monster Girl sharks. At this point, there are a few things that have been turned into, you know, anime girls and things that haven't... I'm pr There's probably an anime girl version of me out there if someone's drawn. Have I thought of playing Maneater? Not particularly. It looks like YouTuber bait, in a way. Like, hello guys, it's your, it's your favorite YouTuber, Dargan here, bringing you more hot Maneater action. I'm gonna just fucking eat everyone, because I'm a shark. Nom nom nom! Hit that like button, hit the bell, and subscribe, comment if you like. Join my Patreon, check out the merch. Uh, my spot, check out my merch, and use my code for your uh, Raid Shadow Legends. Also sponsored by Skillshare. I, I like making not corny YouTuber jokes, by the way. They're always good stuff. Uh, you okay, Vossler? You're looking a little, little gray there. Apparently you're petrified, but I don't, you, you seem like you're- oh, oh! Disappeared before my eyes. Uh, got anything for that in the white magic list? Maybe in the items? No waifu version of me, huh? Well, someone will get on that. Remove stone and pet. Well, I got only got two of these. Love you some Raid Shadow Legends. Do you know? Have you ever played it? Have any of you ever played Raid Shadow Legends? It, are the legends true? Is it really a, an excellent game with thousands of characters? Raid Shadow Legend Legends even exist? Maybe, maybe we're in a simulation. That, that simulation theory and Raid Shadow Legends is actually the reality. It's trying to send us messages. I swear I'm not high tonight, by the way. I've just experienced a lot of drug trips through Far Cry 3. Maybe I got a contact buzz off it. Contact, contact buzz. Hey, look at that. Neptune Jr. Thank you for your, what is it, 22 months of, of, of subscription, my man. I love, I love you. Here is some money. Well, thank you. Uh, make sure you're taking care of yourself, though. <clears throat> you want a waifu version of me? Or else we'll talk about ledge paint. Hmm. That's, that's not really much of a threat. Is Paraguay real? I don't know, but its name is funny to say. And it's really easy to turn into a, you know, a joke when you're a teenager. Paraguay, uh -huh, teach you, you. You mean you mean Paraguay? I'm not, I'm not even really sure if I'm allowed to say gay at this point. I think I am. I think that one's still safe. What would the waifu version of Dardigan be doing? Uh, would she also be a game center? Uh, I doubt. Doubtful. Doubtful. No reason why. She probably would make better life choices, to be honest. 
But there, are, there, there, there is someone who has the exact same monotone and type of voice as me, and it's female. In fact, I'm helping her channel, you know, helping her become a YouTuber. So there's that, but I wouldn't really call that, you know, the waifu eyes version of me. She'd be, a, you think I'd be a Twitch thought? Only, only depending on your, your. Measurements. Pixel Kate, yeah. I'd say the next vote should be between Mafia 2 and LA Noir. I've you know, like I said, I'd have to buy a console version of it. It would take time it would take too long for it to reach to me. Like everything's delayed when it comes to delivery. So I don't even know if I'd get it in time to do a video on it. And I'm thinking I might wait until Mafia 1 comes out and do that first before doing Mafia 2 in this case. Touch the jewel. I've tried the- I tried the digital version of L.A. Noir. That's what I have on Steam. It just will not- I can't get it to work. Jesus Christ. Violence? Okay. Vaughn's asleep. Do you rent games from the library before the... Do I rent games from a library? Is that a possibility? No, I, I buy my games. Okay, I'm gonna have to whack Vaughn with, a, with an axe. Wake up! He only barely survived. You mean the digital version of L.A. Noir? I mean, I could guess I could buy it on console, but I don't know. I'm still debating. I have to come up with whatever I'm going to, you know, put up for vote tonight because uh, everything else is done except for plugging the intro into it. That's right, Vaughn. You keep healing. You keep healing because that's all you're good for. I think we got some license, you know. Keep making fun of Vaughn, he's my highest party level, you know, highest level party member right now. Deadly Premonition, that's still a ways off, but well, uh, well, Deadly Premonition is another one, you can't, the Steam version doesn't work. Ah, oh, god, everything I would actually wouldn't mind doing a video on does not work easily. I can't get a hold of easily either. It's really annoying. Yeah, we got m many, many points to spend. Is, uh, is Vaughn's, yo know, license board supposed to look like a penis, by the way? I I've just now noticed that, but I, hey, it fits him. Okay, dispel. Yeah, give, give me that dispel. Equal oil. Increase magic potency. Gain MP after taking damage. Yeah, that's pretty good. Not a problem for you. Dart again. I, I like that. It makes me sound impressive. Oof. I don't know if there's any any point in you know, unlocking these abilities yet because the game isn't letting me buy them. Maybe I should go up here. some equipment, yo. What if Vaughn vanished from the game? It would play out exactly the same. Nothing would actually change. Alright, you are there. Uh... Ouch. Capture HP critical foes to obtain loot. And what else am I going for? It's got a lot of MP boost down here. 
nothing but HP boosts. Uses physical attack damage. Hmm. We need to get people able to use them actual equipment because it really sucks that they can't right now. All right, what do we want for you? Phoenix lower, Phoenix down, just four more HP. Yeah, that could be good. Increases duration of status effects, remo remedies, remove petrify, potions, uh, yeah, I might actually set her up with the ability to throw potions at people. Might be good. Vaughn is an alright character, he's just not a main character, but he just doesn't... He should actually be someone giving you a side quest, he shouldn't even be on the party as well, look at him. I think, I think that's a, a general statement that works. Alright, uh, Bosch. This is physical attack damage, we want you tanky. Hmm, good stuff. Would you prefer Vaughn to be a cloud co a cloud copy over be nothing? I would prefer him to not be the main character since he isn't. <sighs> so, oh yeah, almost forgot. More characters need your point spent. Do mace. Increase magic power when HP critical. A little bit. Uh, apparently Vaughn needs the right skills have an ad. Vaughn, I see what you're doing with his name, and I don't like it. You almost forgot, did you hear about the rumor that Kingdom Hearts may be getting a series on Disney Plus? Yeah, I did, and I'm wondering if that's going to be its own thing, or it's going to just also somehow work its way into the game, and you'll need to watch the entire show to get the next Kingdom Hearts game. I mean, there's a strong possibility that's going to be the case. The ladder, the ladder will definitely, I know. But it's it's nice to think we live in a world where that would be illegal. Let us dream for the night. You'll watch the series if they include DuckTales, huh? Probably grab a couple of these for her so she can actually use you know, some gambits. What's up, Mike? How you doing? How you... Come in with that... Do you... Check, Mike, do you actually count out each one of those purple hearts you give out when you do it, or is it just muscle memory? Because it seems pretty con... you know, pretty consistent. Ether is restored. Okay. That's all we can spin with her. Alright, that's all... all of our menu fun is not done with. 
Half the altar stone is sunk into the floor. Okay, we need to find another thing. Uh, great. Switch somewhere that will lower this because we can't go climb over that. Alright, so go over this side this time. <clears throat> Mike, you're so popular in chat tonight. This is what happens when you have a positive attitude. Will there ever be a game you thought was better than you expected? There's, You mean a game that surprised me how good it is? That's happened plenty of times. I mean, most recently I could think of that, that bionic binary domain game I played. I expected that to be like a shit show, and I enjoyed it a lot. Even if it was actually a better Gears of War game than like the most recent Gears of War game. So will I be doing after the? Uh, will I be doing the optional espers? Given that they connect the gaps in the license board, I don't know. I, I honestly can't answer that question yet. Some of them you don't. Some of them are optional though. Some of them you get automatically, don't you? Because they're just part of the story. I think. I don't. I don't. I'm not expecting to 100% the game. That's not what I'm. That's why I'm not here. I'm not here for that. I'll eventually be able to string that sentence together. How do you make a tomb for an undead legendary king so boring in its design? One hundred percent in this game is a lot of extra. Yeah, you know, like that one I'm aware of. I think my little brother one hundred percented it, or came very close. Me, I ain't got that kind of time. King Tut's tomb was very tiny. It's really just two rooms. It was just one of the few tombs that had never been, you know, raided. That's really what makes that famous. But I went back here for nothing. Is this more? No, this is not a sewer. This is a tomb. It's just that you've, if you've noticed, a lot of this game's dungeons are also very much MMOE, and that there are just giant corridors and rooms without much really going on in it. There's not a lot of design to them, to be honest. There's nothing really interesting to look at usually. I guess it helped them save time and just make them sprawling, but it ain't exactly fun to walk through them. Bone noises, chat. Because after building the pyramids, the Egyptians were like, fuck that. Well, you would be too. It's like we, got, we, we built three of them already. Tell me we need more? No, we're just gonna dig a hole in the ground and put him there. Wasn't this game supposed to be partially online at some point? I don't think it was. I mean, this was this game came on the heels of FF11, which was their MMO. I think they just took inspiration from that and added some MMO-like stylings and you know gameplay to it, even though it was single player. What the hell, fresh hell was that thing? Why are there suddenly two of them? Okay, I'm starting to get worried this thing isn't dying. Uh, you use the magic on it. Use your magics. Oh, 
Oh, it put oil on me. Oof, that ain't good. I'm covered in goop. Yeah, I've got handkerchiefs though, it's fine. I've got one handkerchief, never mind. Not so fine. Activate wet wipe. Yeah, I think we need more y'all. I think we need a modern day Earthbound, an a fantasy RPG set in our world in y'all modern times. So you would actually be using things like wet wipes uh, for your your, your your inventory. What's my opinion on combat in FF12? Uh, I don't know. Do you like games that play themselves and don't really require you to do anything? Other than just move the character around? That's what you're getting here. I really don't do anything but move my characters in position and then the game starts doing the fighting for me. I might have to click a menu, bring up a menu every once in a while. What's up, heartful butterfly? How you doing? This is your first FF game you ever played? Hmm. I feel kind of bad if this was actually your introduction to, uh, introduction to the series, because there's way better you know, ver games in it. <clears throat> Mine was FF7, and it's weird that I didn't like FF7 at first, because I, I used to call RPGs menu games as a kid. Oh, I mean, I don't get to actually you know, press a button and swing the sword. I got to choose options. So I, I, I almost never ended up playing FF7. Because I was just used to, like, games that played, you know, when I push a button, something would happen. So I, I was really disappointed after I borrowed it from a friend because I thought it was going to be a cool action game with a guy with a big sword. And it ended up being, it ended up being that, but it just, you know, b based around menus. Your first FF is FF7 Remake. Hey, it's not a bad one to start with. It's pretty good. But eventually, I, I kind of got hooked on FF7 after I started. Hey, there's games can tell stories other than your, your girlfriend being captured. And you get the rescuer. That's pretty neat. So I stuck with it. And then my, you know, things happened that I won't give away now because it might be a spoiler from some people who've only never played the remake. Yeah, this is the first FF game where you directly controlled your combat, your character during combat, but I think they... It's, it was a little flawed in its execution. Why? Oh, oh, someone just died. Oh, my bunny girl. I'm sorry. Rip. Fuck. Uh, bring, bring her back. Come back to life! Oh shit, this is one of those glowing orange enemies where they can just one-shot you sometimes. If my girl was captured like a princess, would you make that to a game? If, if my girl was it was a princess, first and foremost, uh, my life is going to be very different than what it is now. Second of all, if she's captured, that's a, you know, a matter of state security. I don't think I'm going to be worried about video games at that point. Oh, oh man, they got my bay. Oh, time to make a platformer. There we go. MP acquired. What if Dex was kidnapped? Hey. She can fend for herself. She's got weapons built into her that nature has provided. Do you like how it would be a platformer? Well, yeah. Platformers are well known for their captured girlfriend storylines. It just works better when it's 2D for some reason. Now, 
let me go. Let me check out my gambits again. I think I can work. You know, be party leader, ally. Okay, she needs to start throwing potions at people. I've got many potions at this point. Change the parameters of that. That should be like anyone whose HP is like 30%. What about Vaughn? Vaughn's got another one. Party leader's target. Mm, so he's, got, he's currently got... Set to heal himself when he's at 70. He heals anyone who's below 50. Raises any ally that dies. I think I should, you know, send him up to do something else as well. Any the, uh, remove beneficial status effect. Why would you ever want to remove a beneficial status effect? Uh, remove poison. Yeah, that, that's a good one to take care of. You could target an enemy with it. Not, but I know you can target undead enemies with you know, healing stuff, but it's better to... He, he's kind of low on MP, and I've only got so many others. So it's good the way it is. Also, check my equipment. I think I can put something better, a better accessory on him now. Good. But that... Oh, raises strength when HP is critical. Doubles the XP earned. No. Sure. Not too shabby. What about you? Okay, I have I've had a better bow for a, for a long time for, but never equipped it. I'm smart, I know. Don't get don't get too jealous. Poison and sap. Raises strength and critical. Uh, I'll put that on her. What about our man bro? I think I got it. Something for you, didn't I? No, I did not. Are you going? To, are you okay, Mike? You, you you like are like three different animals right now. Scale armor gives him more speed, but lowers the defense too much. I'm gonna keep the manufactured nether side on him. It's good stuff. All right, let's check out my party. Who? Uh, Valthier is getting a little under leveled. I might want to switch him out for uh, Ron. Yeah, let's see. What, yeah, let's see. What, Let's switch Fraun out for Balvir real quick. Get him up another level. Mike's a choke a chokamu. A beautiful species. Am I someone that always has the high ground? Well, I'm I'm six one, so I'm a little bit above average male height. So I guess that kind of is that what you're asking. Go get, go get him, Bosch. You're the real main character here. Five six, hey. It ain't the size, man, it's the heart. 
I.e. you're on Twitch? Well, you're on a Twitch chat, but hello to Oddsty's mom. I, I gave you that one for free. You deserved it. You're probably a good son. You just finished Alan Wake and you really liked it. You're starting Nier Automata tomorrow. Well, I'm glad you liked Alan Wake. I like it too. Uh, if you if you own Control, it's apparently getting DLC that it will focus on Alan Wake. So uh, while we're not ever going to get a sequel to Alan Wake, we will get a Control DLC. Vaughn continues to grow in strength. I told you, Chad, you, are, you will be witness to his great becoming. Once the game just allows me to buy your know, white mage spells for him, then he'll be fine. You know, you've been playing GTA 4, and it kind of shows why Rockstar ports suck at times. Oh, are you playing that on PC? That that port is legendarily bad. Alan Wake, but they turned into a visual novel RTS. How would how would you do a visual no novel real-time strategy game? You, well, it's not really Alan Wake if you're not playing as Alan Wake, uh, unless you're playing with Barry. This took a while. Ooh, mi mini lich. Oh shit, don't throw. I just really got oil all over me. I know. Okay, my entire party is covered in oil. Good. Oh yeah, there is a, there's technically a pseudo sequel to Alan Wake called American Nightware. Not night nightwear. Nightmare, but it's also really bad. <clears throat> well, I should well it's not terrible, it's just repetitive, since there's only three levels and you have to repeat those three levels three times. And it gets, after just one cycle through it, you're like, okay, I get it, and I don't like it. that and that lowered that which allows us to go back up here for some reason okay whatever we'll just take the teleporter I need to make sure I go back to the save crystal and you'll know, save and get all this stuff removed from me you wish to remind me that guns don't scale off enemy stats and are great combos for white mages it will become relevant soon, yeah, but the weapon that he's using as a white mage does scale of it. At least I'm pretty sure it does. I should play Alan Wake at some point. I've played Alan Wake several times and I did a video on it. You're, you're saying I should play Alan Wake again, I believe. And that may happen in some, yeah, I, I played it on stream. That was like early, early stream days, back, you know, shortly after I started my stream.
So, may you ask how the vid's coming? Vid is 99% done. I just had to... Uh, Rune has to send me the intro. And I need to figure out what I'm going to put up for the vote. That's really all that's left. As long as Rune sends me the intro tonight, or tomorrow morning, I'll be able to have the video up for you to watch. On Friday. <clears throat> Did I play Wake on Normal or Nightmare? I've actually played it on uh, the hardest difficulty, but not on stream. That was before I became a YouTuber, since uh, that game, I, that's one of the few games I like, yeah, I want to challenge. I want to prove myself tonight. You basically just have to prioritize getting headshots. What am I considering putting up for vote? I haven't decided yet. I've got, I've got a, I've got three weeks until uh, The Last of Us 2, which I'm going to be doing, so I could potentially put up a bigger game that would take me three weeks to make a video on, rather than one that takes two weeks. Okay, week. Did I play Dragon? I've never played a Dragon Quest. You got GTA San Andreas? Yeah, I do, but... I'll, I'll also need to re-record a couple parts of GTA San Andreas because it crashed on me a couple times. We need, we need lock. Fuck, I don't have front on my party. I don't have any actual magic to use on you. Alright, kill it with a physical dex. Just be slow. Seriously, needs better combat. Needs combat music in general. It just feels kind of like nothing's happening when, even when you're fighting. Play Hitman. That might be something I play at some point. I don't think I can make a video on it though. But that's all we're not all we're discussing right now. We're discussing what's to put up for vote. Still like de deliberating on. I need to go back over here or not. Am I going to take a look at Minecraft dungeons? Probably not. I don't see any reason to. It does, I'm not I'm not a huge Minecraft dude anyways, and I'm also not really in, I, too big into isometric RPGs. <clears throat> so it's not really a good formula for me. Plus, you can't even get it on Steam. It's like only on the Microsoft Store right now, isn't it? That's always a great sign. Kill the chicken. Has anyone in chat seen the movie called Look Who's Back? Not me. It's on Game Pass? Yeah, I don't have Game Pass. 
I don't I don't pay for consoles, you know, services. It's against my religion. You're suggesting Tomb Raider or Angel of Darkness. I thought we were friends. And and you throw that one at me. Hey Dargan, there's this little game. I think you should play. Okay, I... I don't know what... There must have been something I was supposed to... Alright, I've hit both of these switches, and I don't know where to go next. Okay, this, this is the thing I lowered, so maybe it's down here. No, it's just a shortcut. You, the viewers, have, would have a blast watching me play Angel of Darkness. I'm willing to wager getting that game to run would be a nightmare. Can I say stars in the Nemesis voice? Stars. Stars. Not fog. Mist. You can see the mist with your eyes? Where it is thick enough, you may. The nether runs deep in this place. So, is the mist dangerous? Yes, but it is also an aid. A dense mist allows the working of powerful magics. Yeah, straight out of FF9 with that, that thing. In mind. Can't count on Vaughn to keep track of these things. That's for sure. How much do I need to be paid to play Mortal Kombat or DC Universe? Well, Chad doesn't need to pay me anything to play a specific game. That's not how I work. So, uh, I don't know, it's just whenever that, it strikes me like, hey, I want to play that right now. That's really it. Uh, these people need to bring a rope ladder with them. It'd make this so much easier. MK11 is getting another expansion. It, didn't it just get one? I mean, hey, I'm glad they're you know, supporting their game. I didn't know it was such a deep, deep storyline. What are you? Uh, you're you're, you're you know, my warning to heal. That's what you are. Call me, just call you Demon, but hope you're doing all right. Uh, well, hey, Demon, I am doing all right, and hope you are too. Praise the Elder Gods? No, consult the Elder Gods. Praising them doesn't seem to do much either. Worshipping, asking them favors? No, nothing works. How am I aware of the meme? I pay attention to things and memes in general. You can learn a lot about things you never played or watched just by looking at the memes. Uh, uh. Let's do let's do this uh, a strategy. I'm gonna I've cut I've got a strategy. First we lower his defense. And now we use a miss move on him. Balthier, we'll start with you. Use the tides of fate. Let me show you how it's done. That's the laziest spell weaving I've ever seen. Well, it's water. It should be good on him, though. Of 
Just hit him with all the Dragon Ball attacks. Okay, wouldn't give me another one there. But we got, we got a pretty good combo on him. Good, good enough, I guess. <clears throat> Honestly, I think I probably would have done more damage to him in that, in that same amount of time. Just, oh, you know, just by attacking. Oh, this is riveting. I'm not doing anything. I'm like, uh-oh. What am I expecting from the RE4 remake? I'm expecting uh, you know, uh, a lot of you know, you know, a lot of in oh, shit. Uh, a remade version of the Merchant really is all I'm looking for at this point. <clears throat> Just be like, what are you buying? That's all I need. Continue to whoop out. out open the whoop ass. I'm gonna lower his defense again. Have anything on this dude that'll do that? Fully consume user's MP, changing one ally's HP to ten times that amount. Oh, 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 okay, so I could give uh, someone 10 times 105 well it wouldn't really it'd be a few extra HP to Vaughn who I need to keep alive we'll try it out why not well a few extra hundred really Good, you missed. You missed, pal. Thank you. Code, there was actually a rumor recently that Code Veronica might end up getting a remake. I don't know how concrete it is, but it's probably years away at best. Uh-oh. Oh, shit! What? Oh, that ain't good. Okay. We, we can still do this. We can still do this. Uh, make sure these two are equipped properly. Go for it. All right. Uh, do, do I have any black magic? Uh, I do. Blizzard should be good. Or Blizzard or Aqua. Deal what? I'm going to guess water damage is what I need to use here. Also, this Belias. Oh, I, this was a... Actually, yeah, this was one of those demons from FF. I mean, FF Tactics, wasn't it? I remember the name now. Oh, thank you for using fire on him, you bunny... Bunny whore. <laughs> 
Sorry, but that was dumb. <laughs> Good move. Well, Pinello saves the day. What's this guy doing down here guarding the tomb of a, a, a dead king? He was a demon who wanted to help take over the world. You have tamed the Esper, Belias, the Gigas. In vain glory they arose, shouting challenges at the Did I get the secret death scene Prevail from Lewis? I think not. I did. Their doom it was to walk the mist until time's end. A legend of the Nemo. My family tells a story of the Dynast King and an Esper. The story goes that in his youth, the Dynast King defeated a mighty Gigas for which the gods took heed of him. Thereafter, it was ever bound to him in thraldom. Does this game ever reference Ramza at any point by chance? Or Delita? I don't remember if it does or not. Not so. The Esper is the Dynast King's treasure. That's your treasure? In this Esper we now command rests a power whose worth is beyond any measure. Can pass the demons so? ain't smart. Call me old fashioned, but I was hoping for a treasure whose worth we could measure. Okay, well. So, uh. Party, uh. We need to switch. We need to bring some people back from the dead. Why did I, I? I'm dumb. I should have just brought him back. He can use spells to do it. That's kind of shitty that they don't lose the status effects even after they they're dead and brought back to life. Healed. The cleansing touch. Fades of black. Are you guys debating the age of a fictional character again? I get creeped out when you do that. Because I, I wonder why you care so much. Especially when the argument is like, no, she's definitely a over 18. Look. Mm. Priorities, chat. Priorities. Don't make me put you in horny jail. Well, I have a gambit on Bond to, like, raise people back from the dead. It's just that usually you don't get that entire team wipe like that. No one is horny- oh, bullshit. I know, I know Chad is horny for anything with boobs. Sometimes you, any, even more so than, you know, natural. Inscription. By this, return you to the Hall of the Destroyer. By other means, return you back to this place. Hey, Goku-san, thank you for the sub. My plastic surgery just we was acting go. up.
Gotta admit, she's got a good outfit. What? <sighs> Chad, who's prettier, her husband or her? It's, it's, it's honestly debatable. Sorry, Bay. Taco Bell calls. Hungry. You will be avenged. Also, pretends to know. Thank you for your sub. Twenty-two months it is. You obtain the Dawn Shard. Can that be equipped by any chance? It can be. Resist magic up by ooh, 20 resist magic. That's good, actually. We'll give it to her since you'll. Seems, seems appropriate. I love how they have Vaughn see it and make no plot difference. Yeah, like I said, Vaughn doesn't matter. He's just there for the ride. Okay, uh... Okay, Bosch is level 16, but we have to keep using him here, I think. No, actually, we can switch out. Let's, like, check the licenses boards. Uh, we'll wait a little bit before we do that. Level up Pinello a bit. And Ash. Now, nope. Both here still needs that level up too. <clears throat> All right. I guess we just leave this place now. We've got nothing left to do. You're hungry? Hmm. I'm in the middle of my fasting period, so hunger can wait. Yeah, I'm aware that Vaughn only exists because Japanese gamers didn't want to play as Bosch. Because they, hell, he's older. How old is Bosch? He doesn't look much older than, like, late 20s at the best. But Japanese gamers are like, no. Give us pretty male leads. We demand it. Square obliged. That's also the reason ne the g that game Nier had two different main characters depending on what wh what region you played it in. If you played Nier in Japan, it had the you know, another pretty boy guy. If you played in America or the Europe, you had like the you know, burly dad dude. How are they handling that bit that part that part of it in remake? <clears throat> Is Burly Dad is Burly Dad Dude version still available? Yeah, I want them to call it that near remastered Burly Dad Dude version. <laughs> near remake is gonna be the kid only, huh? I guess we here in the West have finally just given up. Like, okay, we'll take your pretty voice. You tried starting at something akin to internet, intermittent fasting. Basically, avoid eating between 7 p.m. and 7 a.m. That's a good start. You, eventually, though, you want to hit 16 hours. 16 hours is kind of like where you know, the benefits hit, you know, or you know, land. After that, your body goes into ketosis. So, yeah, but starting for a 12-hour fast is pretty good. Bosch is 36. He's a good, he's a strong 36 then. 
that's the benefits of, you know, not smoking and drinking and just devoting yourself to the royalty. It's probably got a blood boy. Who knows? Such a tremendous honor to again be graced with your presence, Majesty. You left us with such great dispatch upon our last encounter that I must confess I had begun to worry that we may have given your Majesty some cause for offense. Such a heartfelt display of remorse. Now what is it you want? I want you to give me the Nethysite. The Nethysite? That is a base imitation. We seek Wraithwald's legacy, the ancient relics of the Dynast King. They affected Nethysite. Did you not tell them, Captain Azalus? <sighs> oh, he, he did pull the old... He your... speaks of the Dawn Shard. He's, he's a traitor. Are you Just as I suspected, also, because it's also what happened in Star Wars. Accept the truth. I will fight this profitless battle no more. <sighs> Captain Azalus has struck a wise bargain. In return for the Dawn Shard, the Empire will permit Lady Ash to reclaim her throne, and the Kingdom of Dalmasca will be restored. Think on it. An entire kingdom for a stone, you must admit, is more than a fair exchange. And when all is said and done, your master will have another pet. Lady Ash, let us take him for the people of Dalmasca. Your Majesty wallows in indecision on peril of their heads. And his shall be the first to fall. Well, at least your sword is to the point. Who's Darth Vader's equivalent in this game? There are like six Darth Vader's in this game. To think the relics of the Dynast King were deified Nethysite, Dr. Sid will be beside himself. What did you say? Captain Azalus, take them to Shiva. They should have leave to return to Rabanaster soon. No, they're not as cool as Vader. I want you to assess its power. Did our orders not specify that we return the stone for testing? I will not chance returning with a stone that is yet unproven. Have I ever been in a fight? A physical fight? Uh, I had to slam a dude up against a wall in 7th grade. But, I usually got, you know, was either A, too much of a loner for anyone to really give a shit about, or B, learn how to be, be funny and you'll usually de-escalate any situation. That sounds homo- me slamming someone against the wall in school? Okay, I guess if that sounds homoerotic to you. We can announce that you are alive and well. To me, it was me grabbing someone by the shoulders and pushing them against the wall and telling them in the face first I was sick of their shit. I believe Lars has the key. He'll listen to us. We should trust him. Who are you, Vossler, to talk of trust? Why did I slam him against the wall? He's trying to trip me while I was trying to go to the, you know, the cafeteria. He's doing that annoying thing where they stuck his foot in front of my feet. <gasps> my bunny senses. Our equipment here is limited, so we'll be using the ship's drive to make our assessment. Once we've connected the stone, the reaction should be easily measured. Methods do not interest me, only results. <sighs> Such heat! The mist is burning! 
6,800, 6,900, 7,000. This must be Dare Factor Nethersite. The count still climbs. Ah, we found it at last. True deaffected Nethersite. The power of the Dynast King in my hands. <laughs> Blood alone does not an Emperor make, vain. What is this? Something's wrong. What is it? <laughs> you stand. <laughs> Hold her down. What part of her move knocked that guy away? She's still. Uh oh. Uh oh. Feral bunny girl. What's wrong with her? I always knew Fran didn't take well to being tied up. I just never knew how much. How about you? I like Fran's idea. Let's get out of here. No farther! Sky Pirates, the future of Dalmasca will not be stolen. <sighs> I do this, Bosch. This struggle is futile. You must know where it leads. I do know. All too well. Like this dude. Uh, you know, just straight up missed him. Why not? Oh, I haven't. Oh, I haven't. You know, attached to the summon. I could. Or I could have done that. But it's. It's fine. How much you want to bet Vossler is like 10 times stronger than when he was in my party? I don't think I've seen Pinellos yet. Keep hitting him. Do, do the things. Here goes. I never miss. Jesus Christ, he's dead already. I think he's 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 taking a beating. He's just a man. Yeah, we got eight. We got eight full of your missed attacks that are quickenings, and then it's gonna hit him with the combo finisher. He's getting hit with a cataclysm. Hurt me more, Snake! Yeah, he's just fucking dead, instantly. That's how you do a boss fight. Engine power falling rapidly. It's negative. Impossible. Engine we cannot maintain the rate. Report. What are they doing down there? What's happened? Oh, they hired everyone in London for this game, didn't they? Ash, let's go. All I have done, I've ever thought of Delmasca first. I know you do. I would ne'er gainsay your loyalty. Look on what my haste has wrought. Did I act too quick? Or was your return too late? I can serve her no more. You must take up my charge. You just hit me with an entire planet, so yeah, I'm kind of done.
Uh oh. All because he wanted to like check out the stone. Entire fleet goes boom. Boom! Like happy fireworks festival. Yeah? How did you see that, that far away, that tiny little thing? Must go faster. The dreadnought Leviathan is sunk. The eighth fleet of the Arcadian Imperial Army lost. As word of the events in the yacht sounded throughout the Empire, quit I, Bujerba, citing sudden malady, my true motive. To bring the various counter-imperial forces scattered throughout Ivalice together in unified resistance. By this time, Lady Ash had made her return to Rabanasta. She had not, however, made known her presence. Rather, she was content with keeping both her own whereabouts and those of the Don Shard concealed. Had she chosen then to go before her people, my error in announcing her suicide would be known to the great detriment of my efforts to assemble a resistance. Hey, Lazy, thank you for your 13 months up. ...as the Lady Ash then found herself. Even were she to proclaim Dalmasca restored, it would serve only to invite the Empire's wrath. Is this the end of the game? No. Though Arcadia had lost her eighth fleet, she remained, as ever, a military power with which to be reckoned. So I asked earlier, I don't know if someone answered me in chat, does this game ever reference uh, Ramza and Delita, the two main characters from Tactics? Like even in passing for something? I can't recall if it did or not. This is a fantasy game, by the way. Hard to tell, I know, but every frame is so dense. It's the busiest movie we've ever made. This might as well be Coruscant. Do I use Epic Game Store for free games? Well, I don't usually use Epic Game Store. The Rosarian Empire assembles a vast host under guise of martial exercises. It is our belief they wait for the proper pretext, the sooner to make their strike against Arcadia. The loss of Leviathan and her fleet at such a time comes as a most grievous blow. Were Azaria to invade, the battle would be hard fought. Had Lord Vane not deployed the fleet so capriciously, we would not now find ourselves in such perilous... Ch uh, Chad, do you think you would put someone named Vane in charge of an entire fleet? Shall be made to answer for his actions. It is the will. You might as well just call him Darth Bane. No just just get, get, get it out of your system. You know you wanted to. A convenient thing, Justice. And so I must now make a choice between my throne and my son. A most lamentable situation for us all. Oh, for Lord Vane, perhaps. Yet surely Lord Lancer will make for a fine emperor. Lancer so adores his brother, and he is yet young. But he will not remain young forever. Already he busies himself unraveling Lord Vane's tangled skein. Lord Larsa has found his role to play and pursues it with some enthusiasm. Ah, yes. And who would set him at such tasks? What matter? Lord Vane himself once saw his elder brothers brought to like justice, did he not? At your excellency's behest, as I recall. 
Oh, sorry, my plot cough. Did I like this game when it came out? I kind of stopped playing it after a while. Arcadia's well-being will ever be insured. FF12 and Tactics are separated by an apocalypse. Wow. In vain return to Arcades. That, that might have been a better idea for the game then. Whatever that apocalypse was. I kind of thought we prevented that apocalypse in Final Fantasy Tactics. Okay, ghost, ghost lover, you're... You're going to have to do the old sway, Swayze this up and make some pottery with me or just stop standing around. Tomb of Wraithwall had the summon. Yeah, I think the summons I think are the only reference. Which is sad. I like I like the story of tactics. Basically, the story of tactics is very political too, but it's way better than this one. So Vaughn would just stand in there, huh? Watching. Oh, cool. Did I reach the lighthouse? That's actually where I stopped. So, it was the Dawn Shard that brought down the Imperial fleet. You know your stuff. Destructive power of such force. I've seen it once before. Lady Ash, you know of what I speak. Nabudis. The capital of old Nebradia, Lord Rassler's fatherland. At the time of the invasion, a division of Imperials entered the city. There was a mighty explosion. Friend and foe died alike. Something was there. One of the Dynast King's relics. The Midlight Shard was in Nebradia. More Nethocide. Well, no wonder they invaded. That ridiculous war. The trap at the treaty signing. All this because Vane wanted power. He must not be allowed to claim the Nethocite. The Empire must never hold it. Oh, they already do. The Dusk Shard, most likely the Midlight Shard, too. Besides, can't they manufacture Nethocite now? Very well. Then the path set before us is clear. We'll use the Dawn Shard to fight them. Dalmasca does not forget kindness, nor ill deed done. With sword in hand, she aids her allies. Sword in hand, she lays to rest her foes. This Nethocite I hold must be my sword. I will avenge those who have died. And the Empire will know remorse. You even know how to use it? I... Wait, spoil the, the moment. Gareth, they know. The Gareth people live by the old ways. Matricide lore is a part of their culture. They may hear it. The cry of the Nethersite's power. Whispers of the stone's menace. Dangerous though it be, what we need now is power. Should we declare power free without the means I to defend need our claim, more the Empire would crush power. us. You must take me to meet with the Gareth. They live beyond Osman Plain. Not exactly close. Compensation, is that what you want? Straight to the point, aren't we? I like that. Compensation? How about the ring? This? Isn't there something else? No one's forcing you. <laughs> I'll give it back to you as soon as I find something more valuable. What do you mean something more valuable? Hard to say. I'll know when I find it. Sounds like a Shakespearean rap battle. Oh. What are you looking for? Me? What am I looking for? I... I guess... Well, I... Uh, you know... 
our main character, ladies and gentlemen. The Strong main character moves. Well so they do. We'll need to head south, past the Giza plains. It is the range now in Giza. The Wadis will be swollen with the deluge. Passage may be difficult. But those same waters may also lay open new routes to us. Regardless, we must go south, yes? Go first south, things yeah. first. You're eager to be on your way, I know. But we should see that we're prepared before setting out. I made my resolve two years ago. I swore to overcome any hardship I may face. Man cannot live by resolve alone, princess. I'm not sure who has the better ass. You know, Fraun or Balthier? I mean, look at that. that. That is some tight jeans. Okay, uh... First, I need to start a fresh recording, because I still don't trust this game about to crash. Okay, we need to go shopping for magic spells. How much money do we got? Barely any. Do the hunts. I think Crocodile just unlocked. I don't really want to. Problem. Uh, you going to bed, Western? You have a good night. Can you call what Ash is wearing a skirt? It looks more like a white... Well, she's got a belt over top of her skirt, so it can't really be a belt in that case. You can't really wear a belt uh, over top of a belt unless you're designed by Nomura, and these characters were not, were not designed by Nomura. Is this on the docket for next video? I don't think it is, but who knows? I might change my mind between now and the next couple hours. thought there was a distinct lack of belts in this game. Yeah, this one, this, I don't know if Nomura had anything to do with this game, actually. He might have, but it was probably very little. As you notice, the plot is, you know, kind of meh, but at least it's straightforward and you know what's happening. Who's worse, Vaughn or Lightning? Lightning. Don't even have to think about that one. Let's sell stuff. Charles the Green. Uh, new bizarre goods are available. Look at your class, your classes board. I will. I know I gotta equip that spell, but I'm—I mean the, the summon. But I wanted to see if there's like new magic spells I can buy that are good. Of course there wouldn't be. Why would? Why would they give me that? Right, buy an arrow. You've lost your brain? Hmm. Did you check the dryer? License for the Esper Belias has been added to the board. <clears throat> Only one character can obtain this license. When the character obtains a license, it will be removed from the boards of all other characters. Second board license has been added to the license board. Characters who have earned the second board license can access an additional license board. Second board, additional license board unlocked. So where's the summon thing on the board? Is it in like a special spot somewhere? Or is it, or is it this right here? Oh, there it is. I see. <clears throat> Alright, I think we should, you know, I don't know if we want this on him or not, but we should definitely get the second board. We'll grab this first. You will be unable to return to the license menu until you confirm your new board proceed. Wait, what? Don't make it sound scary. Check some other people out. Uh, 
wherever that is that's not viewable on his. Ron also has it. Second board equals second clay. I know that much. But once we take that, we can only put that on one person that disappears from everyone else's board, right? So, I've got to think about who I want to be able to use that. Uh, I might give it to Bosch. I'll give it to Bosch. Why not? All right. What do we want to make Bosch now that he <clears throat> Bosch is currently a foe breaker? So we should turn him into something else. We can make up a time battle mage, or just a straight up, you know, knight. Grand Theft Auto Online still netting Rockstar one million a day. Well, yeah, it's a good big game. Or we can make him a samurai. Oh no, no, Bushi. Hmm. You want to make someone said someone in chat says full night. I've heard isn't that good. Uh, I think I'll make him a bushi. Why not? Hmm. That's a very weird question, Gotetsu. I'm sorry, but I'm not gonna answer it either. I'm gonna go with the Bushi. Learn the way of the blade, my friend. Lord Masters should devote themselves. All right, now he's got a, he's got a big big board. So what about Vaughn? Vaughn's currently a pretty high level white mage, but he just we just can't find spells that are on sale. So what else should we make of Vaughn? We could make him a ninja. He could be a ninja white mage. Time. Well, we could also make him a time battle mage, I guess. Hmm. I think I'm going to make him a Shikari. Why not? Make Vaughn either Ulan or Shikari. I'm gonna go with Shikari. I've heard Ulan is like very bad or something. I'll make him, you know, Vaughn could be a, a white mage ninja. All right, Shoo, All right, Pinello. I'm gonna make into a monk. I think I think I decided that earlier that she'd be a monk and a black mage. Have you tried the stores in Nalbina, the city of the dead? We haven't been there yet. So, she's currently Black Mage. I think I'll make her a Monk. Either that or a Time Battle Mage, I think. Hmm. Yeah, or maybe I should keep her a... Ma ma mm, I'm not sure. Supposedly, Pinello has, like, good magic stats, correct? Maybe I'll make Fron a monk as one instead. 
Penelope, Penelope is a better white mage. Ash is a better black mage. Well, I've already got, yo, know, Vaughn as my white mage. So maybe I can make, yo, know, Penelope a white mage and a black mage. He's already the black mage. But I'm thinking of, you know, making her a time battle mage instead. Hey, Daciana, welcome back to the stream. I guess you got the night off. Why is this such a difficult decision to make? New game? Well, this isn't a new game, but and I've been playing for several days in a row. You can reset it. Eh, it's fine. I'm mainly gonna be using her magic, her black magic anyway. So whatever this is, is just like you know, free real estate. Uh, Will's crossbows and bin, bin's time to her will. You know, I'll just make her a white mage. She can be a just pure mage character. She's black and white. Okay, so someone someone said make uh, Fron into a what a time battle mage. Hmm. Sure. All right. So. What should we make Ash? Not really. I've already made Ash into something. Never mind. And, uh, no, no, there it is. Oh, well, let me choose that. Weird. Oh, because I haven't unlocked one of the ones next to it, I think. All right, you know what? You can have Belias. Sure, take it. I have to give it to someone. Character now can summon espers under the mist command of the battle menu. So. Ash is currently a red battle mage. I think someone said she makes a good black mage. Sure, why not? And I think we've already, you know, we've already done it with everyone else. Okay, I think everyone's got their second board added to it. Now he's gonna, we'll wait before we spend any points. Knight is a very good class. Apparently not on my team, it isn't because I haven't used it. I didn't do Balthier's second board? No, you're right. I'm not sure what to make him. I guess maybe a Nulon for him? He's a machinist right now, but maybe I can make him into my knight or a monk. Make him into a monk. Hmm. I think it's down between monk or knight. Monk works for him? Yeah, we'll go with monk. All right, there we go. Let's see if there's any weapons or equipment we can buy. <clears throat> Night for Genji gear, you say? What do you have from her? Oof. Everything's too expensive for me to buy. 
No one can even use it. Or it's just not good with them. Okay, the Warhammer he, uh, Bosch can use. Bosch can get himself a war. You know, you know what? I think I want to save my money for now. Yeah, I think that's a better idea. None of that seems worth getting. <clears throat> so, I think we're just going to leave. I think we're good. We need to go head south, I believe. Progress chat. That's what we're looking for. Docking is repeated unwanted interactions. You learned that in a sin video, so no. Someone suggested doing hunts, but I really don't want to. It's just that hunts are nothing more than an elaborate way of grinding, so you don't notice. You know, I haven't wrote a chocobo yet in this game. 500 guild? Sure. Let's hear what the chocobo music sounds like. What's that you've not written a chocobo? Not to worry. Just be mindful that you've a limited amount of time for your ride. What? Off you go now. Quite a treat watching the world fly by from your perch in the saddle, Koopo. Mounted combat. No. This is kind of like a very low, very low key version of your the chocobo music. Yeah, okay. yeah, sure. What? Yeah, here, here it is. I don't even recognize it. Fiery choke. I don't know what that did, but I made the chocobo angry. Oh, this made it run faster. I get you. Food time? Oh. Oh, I gave it a Gyarshal green. I see. We should check this town over here. They might have your good stuff. I know there's a time limit. Oh, this town is gone. Oof. Packed up, did they? The move out when it starts raining, oh, the monsoon season, I see. You feed her e chocolate. What is e chocolate? Chad is talking about food right now. That's mean. You'll to talk about food around a guy who's in his fasting period. Burgers, chocolate. Mmm, good stuff that you can't have right now. I'm gonna regret running past all these enemies later when I get reach a, a level that you know, oh you didn't grind, you know, get fucked.
I might have to whip up a, you know, take one of my frozen bananas and add some, you know, choco, you know, some cocoa to it. Makes for a nice treat. Yes, mini quest we're head. It's an appropriate sound effect to use now. Time to find a horse. You know, I got used, so used to playing 7 where you have to scan everything that I just... just maybe I should be doing that more. Too many quests are now being used in chat. I just realized my party composition really blows right now. I've got no real damage. One gill. Thank you, game. All right, let's yo <clears throat> change this party up. Uh, okay, who's who's the proper level? Okay, they're all pretty much the same thing. All right, Sue. So we're gonna put Bosch in there. Uh, actually, we'll bring Ash out. Get those two at the level 16 first, then these two. Killed Roy, oddly enough, you don't... I don't want off Dardigan's wild ride. Is this a wild ride tonight? I feel it's a fairly tame ride. And there's only so much you can do or say... Oh, Snick, uh, when you're playing this game. And then yeah, it does give me a lot of time to look, look at chat, because I don't really have to do much. Maybe I should set your know, Pinello up to use some of her actual spells so I have the commander to do that. That'd be nice. One of these slow months when there isn't something new for you to do, do Okami on a weekend. I'll do Okami eventually. I like that game, actually. It's good. It's just, it's a long game, so I had to, you know, make sure I have some time for it. Alright, let's sort of the gambits. Yeah, you know, no wonder she doesn't do anything. HP 100, you will... cast poison on it, I guess. Party leader's target, you can, you know, cast... Uh... Fire on. Oh, targeting you, cast your thunder on him. Or blind, you know, blind.
I think you're missing some spells. You already had Kira? Well, I've, I've gone to every store and tried to find one that sells Kira. No one sells it. Oh, with Lois. No, you can cast... Aquan. No, Arrow. Just making her really offensive with magic right now. I don't know why. I, it's probably stupid, but hey, why not? What about you, Vaughn? You got... No, you're still in your heal state. Good. Uh, good for now. There are gambits like if for a week to ice. Yeah, I, I, I haven't bought many. I, I need to go to the gambit store and you know, buy ideas, apparently. I hate that. I hate the gambit system so much, by the way. I, I will continue to say that. It's the worst thing about this. Okay, you're that ain't gonna work. Oh. It's just a nightmare to try to program something and enjoy the game. I don't know why they did that. I'm glad they came up with a better way in 7 Remake, though. Arrow seemed like it did the most. Are you, are you kidding me? What is this, Monster Hunter? Uh. Eh, we'll let you live. Draw was better because at least you didn't have to fucking <clears throat> butt it to use it while. I always used it and it was never a good thing. It's like, hey, new enemy, let's sit here and draw spells from it for the next 30 minutes. By the 1000 needles technique, it's an attack that does, yeah, I know what 1000 needle does. But I don't know where it would be on who would have it on their board or where when I'll get to that. Or what store will sell it is another question. There's too much that you'll discover. It's just a busy, busy system. I think I can immobilize you. Nope. Forgot. All, all, all time spells suck, don't they? Always do. Uh, put it to sleep. I'm about to use a summon on this damn thing. Have I loaded the magic stores after unlocking Pinello and Ash? Yeah, I went there. I went to the magic store right before I left, you know, Rub and Aster. Nothing new. There wasn't anything new there for me. I think this is. I think in this version they've changed some stuff from the original chat. So what you remember might not be the same anymore. Please, kill, kill. Thank you. Jesus Christ, these... These, these, these three kind of suck for this place. We're, we're swapping out, we need range. Vaughn, you can go bye-bye for a while. You're you're too leveled up as it is.
This party is doing almost no yell, but we, they couldn't hit it, is the problem. He silenced? He silenced because of an item he has on him. But the benefits are worth it. He doesn't really use magic anyways. Is this game repetitive and boring? It is. I mean, there's parts of the game I really like, like the world is interesting, and I, I wish there, you know, the dungeons were a bit better, but the combat just kills it, because it just doesn't feel engaging. Or at least not to me. Who was wrong before darting in the Dawn Shard is the item that reduces your MP to zero? Uh... I think it's actually on Ash. Well, it was on Ash, but it got taken away from her. Yeah, it, magic resists, but it reduces your MP to zero. Don't have that on anyone right now, but she needs something on her. Wish they would remake Tactics, Adva Tactics Advance. You know, that'd make a good Switch game, using like a retro style art that they're using for like, you know, Bravely Default 2. Or what was that, that, that other game they made uh, for the Switch, the Octopath Traveler? That could be good for, you know, a tactics game as well. You two gonna attack? No oh, fucking, Jesus, don't go over there. Right, there we go. There's those two levels I was looking for. Alright. Friend, you can go out. I need both here up to level 16. As we as her. As we have someone with range, it's fine. Legend of Dragoon, good game. You know, if that game got remade, people would be arguing about the size of that the, the elf girl's boobs. Just like they did over Tifa's. What a time to be alive. You know, this might not be good. You know, it, this ain't good at all, actually, now that I look at things. when they bring friends suddenly. Yeah, I said elf girl, I meant wingly, by the way, and that's what they're called. For those of you who care about the, you know, the Legend of Dragoon lore. Tea's cold, but you can't reheat it because your parents have gone to bed. You know, a tea kettle that'll you know make a loud, loud whistle, or you could use a microwave to you know stealth do it. That's usually not too big of a problem. The microwave is right. Really? They keep the microwave by their bed? I've never heard of that situation. That's kind of bizarre. Can I ask why? Not to be insulting or anything, I'm just curious now. Small, I guess it could be a small apartment.
they sleep in the kitchen? I mean, it's a possibility. What even is that? There's no way I can beat all three if they, if they get aggroed. Well, four birds, three birds, and whatever this thing, this, this nightmare is. <laughs> no, we're running. Nothing, nothing we can do here. Too many, too much stuff. Jesus Christ, I'm getting my ass stomped. Kill. <laughs> Hurry. <laughs> Maximum burger, huh? Are you, are you actually just eating a burger or did you just want to yell that out? Combining two burgers is a very common thing, though. That's not a maximum burger. That's the old double patty. You ate a thin crust pizza. I'm gonna be making pizza again soon. And mine's actually gonna make. I'm gonna make my crust thinner by using a rolling pin this time. Usually, I always you'll, use you'll shape it with hand. This time, I'm gonna use a rolling pin, and you'll get the crust a more even you know, thin you know, thickness. I need to get your tomatoes though, for the sauce. You can see the moon in game or where you're at. You like making homemade burger patties? I, I want to make pulled pork, uh, homemade pulled pork zone. I just need to get a Dutch oven. Squinting? Squinting would help. Yeah, squinting always helps. I don't know where the fuck I'm going. So I'm at the, the Gareth village should be south. I just keep going south, apparently. 100% New York burger. What what makes a burger New York? I know, I know, you know, New York has its food culture, but I've, usually it's, to me, that's usually like hot dogs, Italian food, or pizza. I didn't know there was a New York burger. Yeah, I'm gonna get a Dutch oven. I don't care what your fart jokes are. Dutch ovens are useful for cooking lots of things. Like pulled pork. we had a cooking channel well apparently the you know, what is it history and science or whatever it was has become the cooking channel on the discord at least that's where everyone's been posting all their food porn <laughs> only because of mods uh, we'll, we'll probably eventually make a food channel if people keep, you know, wanting to keep posting and talking about food. Bro, he's going through all my potions. Would I would this would I play RTS games? I've never been into RTS games. Not been my thing. Okay, 
just keep going south, I guess. Eat Dardigan. Eat is good? Or are you saying eating me is good? I'm Wait, are these like evil chocobos? I'm sorry, what? That's new? I don't... I've never seen that in one of their... Yeah, oh, oh, I see. We gotta kill the black chocobos. Uh, thank you, game. <clears throat> little, little subtle. Little, not un... Blah, blah, ah, fuck it. Let's get ourselves in the nightly news. Oh shit, they're not joking around. Oh shit, uh... Uh... I'm gonna, kill. I'm gonna have to miss... These black jokabos are no joke. Unleash the tides of the fires of war upon the black chocobo. Yeah, I'm, I'm quickening to take care of some chocobos because they're, they're they're just fucking destroying me. Bad timing. Hey, I didn't plan on it. I don't know if that has area effect on it or not. I don't think it does. I think we just overkilled one chocobo. Nope. Oh, took care of them all. Oh, I just realized Vaughn is completely out of MP. Switch up our party. Vaughn is level twenty. He's he's where he needs to be. It's the other ones that need to be you know be on his his get on Vaughn's level, chat. All right, let's switch Vaughn out. Uh, Brosh, we need you. It's like it's time to grind. Well, the, the, what do you think this entire area is for? This is bizarre. I guess if you ride it, you can ride a chocobo through there. That's what the game is telling me. But I left my chocobo behind. Well, it, it didn't have enough time to ride it down here, so doesn't matter. Now the Bosch is on the party. He should. We should. This should be going a little bit better. He can actually deal some damage. Use the speed. I'm worried if I do that, I'm going to kill myself right now. Speed can be dangerous once you're like once you're actually fighting against enemies that can do some damage to you. Unlike those little like sand ninja people. Ooh, not sure what that is, but it's glowing red. Oh, it's dead. Never mind. Or even are you? No, you you deal with it. No, you you idiots. You know what? Kill it now. That we're he's already. Hmm. I think, I think she's got cure on her. Yeah. Need to set up a gambit for her to use cure. Anyone wondering where the party members go? Nah, not really. I don't think anyone really cares about that. Uh, you need a gambit for heals. Okay, ally. Actually, she does. Mm hmm. But those aren't there. Good. Yeah, I know that's an NPC out hunting. Uh... 
on board Black Chocobos. We're in the wrong neighborhood, chat. I'm sorry, but th these jokes write themselves. What do you expect? So does this guy just make his enemies go berserk because he wants the extra challenge? Because that seems like it's what he does. I think we need to like use our licenses now. And we get some points of spin. Magic potency. No, that's good stuff. Good stuff there. And one foe vulnerable to an additional element. Alright, uh. You. Berserk prevents the casting of spells. Mm. Increase max HP, increase magic potency. Uh, we could, you know, let him use a sword. I don't know if that'd be better for him, though. Jesus Christ, Ribbon has 215 license points to use. This is max HP. Ruin and in, in, ruin impended is 125. Uh, I think I'll save up for that. Weird dessert. What is your weird dessert? Ninja sword. This is Matt. Yeah, we need an extra HP. Uh, gain MP after taking damage. Increase physical attack damage right now. We need that more than anything else. Deal damage that increases with successive hits. They'll hold off on those points. Spin them later. Got that. Actually, you know what? Bad game. This magic potency is. Old amulet. I'm not really sure what the direction to take with her. I guess I start learning the time magic. That's all we can do for now. I'm worried about finding the black chocobos on. I might want to run past these. Jesus! It ain't my fault! Hit me in the back of the fucking, I got a snake chasing me. Barely made it. Land the Garf. Chad, would you ever want to play an RPG where you just like come across the land of the Garfield? There's nothing but NPCs that are Garfield. That, that sounds wonderful to me. Like a map, I would. Uh, am I scared of the black chocobo? Well, they are intimidating. I'm not gonna lie.
would Odie be there? Odie would be dead if he was surrounded by too many Garfields. He'd only be kicked off the table so many times. You know, the only thing that's even... The only thing that is good that has ever came out of Garfield is all the Garfield memes, which have been a hundred thousand times more funny than the comic or cartoon ever was. Black chocobos aren't a threat only if you hard grind. Well, that's every enemy in the game, then. That enemy isn't a threat if you grind beyond its level and you can easily kill it. it can be said about everything. Who are you? This is Garfland. No place for Hume children to go play at games. Garf. They are wayfarers. They bring no harm. Saw them cross the Osmond Plain. They are warriors of great distinction. They ran from Black Chocobo like coward. The fiends of the plains trouble them not at all. You ventured upon the plains alone, War Chief? Again? What business have you with a Garf? Let them pass. Responsibility will be mine. This is your wish, War Chief. But you may pass. These days see many Humes wandering through our lands. You like the Garfield movies as a kid, but you haven't seen them since. Do you know if they are any good? Uh, most things you liked as a kid will not be the same as an adult. Why are they talking to Vaughn? He's not our representative. Oh, I have not made introductions. I am Supinelu. Supinelu. Sure, whatever. War chief of this village. We Garf have been friends to all since long ago. However, lately the Hume world is in much turmoil. We must protect our village and our people. As war chief, the protector of... I like how he says we, we are a peaceful people, but his title is literally war chief. I ask you, why have you come to this land? Hmm, I see. So you too have come to ask about the Nethosite. You must speak with the elders. Though our masks may make it difficult for you to tell us apart. Jesus game. Walk through the village and look with your eyes. Listen with your ears. I can't tell those Garfs apart. They look the same. Come at me, Garf! <laughs> Sunbathing Garf. That's Mascus. Are those horns or giant ears they have on their head? Can't tell because of the mask. Whatever, it's probably hard to put that thing on around them. What is this? Another human visitor to our land. This is most unusual. Have you two come to speak with the Elder Chieftains? Peace through war. Garf, Garf, lion -o. Oh, you are the Hume the War Chief has spoken of. You have crossed the plains to learn of the stones, yes. I believe the Elders can tell you much. seem a great warrior, but it is best you avoid Zertinian caverns. There are many fell creatures there, and of, of late worse. A being with strange powers has been seen. Perhaps this is why the other creatures there have grown yet more violent. The game is telling you they didn't have any money to make them look different. They only made one character model. Hey, we spent all of our money making all the Moogles look really super cute, alright? No one was going to care about the, the Garfs. That's what, why do you think we named them the Garf? So you would forget about them. And I totally forgot about these guys. I do not remember them at all. What's a female Garf look like? We're getting into that, that Mass Effect you know, problem where they only have male versions of certain aliens. Green creatures you see in my enclosure are nanas. The best livestock in all Ibelis. No part of the nana goes to I'm sorry, I can't take that serious. Nana. 
meat, hide, and bones all have their uses. They are strong against drought and cold, and oh yes, easily herded. They look like a parrot combined with a sheep and a frog. We have to look of one of who wishes to know something. It is something that I know good. Ah, the Nethysite. You are not the only one who has asked me about this. It saddens me to admit that I know nothing of the stone. Magicite contains within it a great power. Thus, have we worshipped the stones from the beginning of time, yet I had never heard of this Nethysite. You might ask the other elders. I am sorry. I cannot aid you. Greetings. You are a traveler, yes? Our village is not like a human village. You are welcome to find what comfort here as you may. No stores at all. There's wood wood in the southeast of here, where the mist is uncommonly thick. Even its flowers are perilous to man. If you pass through that wood, be wary of places where the mist runs thickest. Hermaphrodite species, you say. Do you need anything? Where's the fun in that, though? Please take your time, for the world has much of it for the taking. Chocobo feather. What do you sell? Traveler, deal damage, poach, horology, and charge. Those are really expensive. <clears throat> they don't really seem that useful. <clears throat> what did you study in college? Horology. Deal damage based on the factor of time to all foes in range. Yeah. Titanic fails, MP is reduced to zero. License needed, charge. Well, I guess if your MP is already low, that might be useful. Char yeah, charge might be good for everyone who has it. But no spells, no magics. There we go. Have I already bought Kira? And I just haven't unlocked it? Because it, apparently I have, because it won't let me buy it. Bleed. Heavily damage one foe over time. Which, that sounds the same as poison to me. She'll buy it. Oh, wait. Hmm. Hmm. So goddamn expensive. There's some more stuff I'm not using that I can sell. None of it's going to make me much money, though. I'm never going to use these again, so might as well. There's only one piece of fan art on female Garf. The internet disappoints you. Like I said, they were not apparently very popular. And why should they be? Konami code yourself super rich. Well, if I wanted to, I could just enter the, the... This game literally comes with its Konami codes in the menu. If I wanted to, I could turn on your uh, infinite uh, license points and just max out everything. Don't need it. 
She's the only archer they use can use it, so we'll sell that. Uh might as well sell this shit. Maybe now we can buy a weapon or two. Mustache license is the hands of the hands of a mortal blasphemer. All right, so what do we want? What can we even use? All right, Bosch. Bosch is really good right now, so we might want to get that for him. He's kind of my main damage dealer. All the other stuff I can't even equip because I don't got a license for it. I think I will get that for him. Because he's been on the same broad, broad axe for a while. Alright, that's all we got really money for right now. There are different monographs for different persuasions of adventure. As a merchant, I would be loved one. If only I knew where I might want to be found. War Chief Supinlu. Have you learned what you wished? No, do not tell me. It is written clear upon your face, so the elders could not help. Then you must meet with the Great Chief. I would meet this Great Chief. Can I say license with, but like, license? I have been saying it that way. The license for that, man. Yes, it is true. The Great Chief may know something that would aid you. Yet arranging an audience may be quite difficult. I must learn more about the Nethesite. I cannot turn back now. Please, tell me your great chief that I am the royal line of Dalmasca, a direct descendant of Dynast King Wraithwall. The, gar the Garf have passed on knowledge of the stones. They must know the Nethesite that the Dynast King once held. Do you have proof of your heritage? I, I do not. Hmm... I have looked into your eyes and seen that you speak the truth. That easy, huh, human child? I give you my trust. The great chief is ahead, across the bridge. Look, another village over there in the, in the background. So, just so we're all on the same page, these are clearly meant to be like Native Americans, right? Ah, Hume Child, it is unusual for your kind to visit us here in our knoll. You come to speak with the Great Chief? It's the meeting place before the bridge, you will know it by the guard standing at the entrance. Right down that sin that literally has the proof of her lineage, the Dawn Shard, on her back pocket. Well, that's not really the proof of her lineage. The proof of her lineage was that other stone we you know, took from the castle earlier in the game. There is a rich magicide vein near this village, did you know? It is an important and very holy place to us. Yet in recent years, Humes have spoiled the land. They use machines to mine more and more of the stones. They steal power from the earth, their own peril, but the earth will surely take it back. Oh. We got there. Oh, good move. How are you gonna counter? Actually, where can they move to? There's only a few unoccupied spaces on the board. What do you think the rules are? See you later, GMZ. The Great Chief is ahead. Will you meet with him? Meet with the Great Chief. It's like an avocado, kind of. You have used it. It was not I who used it. Indeed, I had hoped you could show me how. Thus, I've come. Hmm. 
You do not know the workings of the stone, then we are no different. What? Sleep. See you later, Mike. In past, the gods made a gift of Nethysite to my people. But the manner of its use eluded us. Displeased by our failure, the gods took back their stones. They were too stupid they to use their magical to item. Give them to a Yum king. Called the Dynast King, he used the Nethysite's power to bring peace to a troubled time. It is a curious thing. Though the blood of King Wraith will flow through your veins, you cannot wield Nethysite. Cannot wield it? So then, am I to understand you can't tell me how to use the stone? Though it shame me so to admit, here before me stands a descendant of the Dynast King himself, and I can accord her no help at all. Still, even if you knew how to use the Nethysite, you would find it of small avail. The mist collected in the stone over ages past is lost, and with it, the stone's power. It will be your posterity who will the stone in ages yet to come. <sighs> I'm here. Hi. This stone is devoid of power. Empty, yet full of thirst. A terrible longing to drink the world dry. The power of men and of magic. Of good and of evil. It is often those who desire Nethysite whom the Nethysite itself desires. <sighs> yeah, what's up? I just walked here. Larsa? So easy to track these these people down. To Baromi says. I say we ought leave tomorrow. I was going to wait for my escort to return, but meeting you here has presented a great opportunity. This terrible war can be stopped, but I will need your help to do so. A war. You know the Marquis Ondor leads a group of insurgents. Your pardon. He leads a large resistance force against the Empire. Lady Ash, neither of our countries can afford this now. The Rosarian Empire would stir. They would aid the resistance and use this aid as a pretext to declare war on Arcadia. And Arcadia would have no choice but to answer. Lady Ash, let us go to Bur Omasais. With the blessing of his grace, the Grand Kiltius Anastasis, you may rightly wear your crown and declare the restoration Go of the, see the Pope. of Dalmasca. As queen, you can call for peace between the Empire and Dalmasca and stop Marquis Ondor. Uh, for peace? How dare you say that? The Empire attacked us. Stole have I done a face dear. reveal? Yes. And you would have me save them from war? Dalmasca would be the battlefield. What if Nethysite were used on Rabinaster? You know my brother would do this. <sighs> my, my face is no, uh, yo, mystery. I presumed over much. I could think of no other way to avoid bloodshed. If you cannot trust me, then please take me as your hostage. What would you actually call that thing she wears for her top? I can't come up with a name. Rustler. It's like pieces of things. <clears throat> you saw me. Didn't you? Haven't watched enough. I, I had the king's tomb. Oh, did you think I was actually a main character for a second? No. So you did see him too, but why? It's Finish strange. with face reveals. It's just I use one every once in a while. Before, I didn't even know what you looked like. And the prince? I barely knew there was a prince. Who knows? Maybe the person I saw was my brother. I mean, it's a nice design, but I could not give you a name for what it is. He enlisted right at the end. See you later, Pop. 
He knew he couldn't win. To protect something. How could he protect anything when he's dead? Was it different for Prince Rassler? Did that make sense? Hating the Empire, getting revenge, it's all I ever thought about. But I never did anything about it. I mean, I realized there was nothing I could do. It made me feel hollow, alone. Fashion show outfit. And then I'd miss my brother. I'd say stuff like, I'm gonna be a sky pirate or some other stupid thing. Just anything to keep my mind off it. This guy became a rapper after this game, by the way. I was just, I was running away. He's actually a hard individual. I needed to get away from his death. That's why I followed you. You know what? I'm through with it. I'm through running. Is he at least yo decent in uh, in the Dissidia games by any chance? Answers. Does he does he make a mark there? If I stick with you, I think I will. Him and his penis haircut, which I just now noticed. If you look at the shape of it, is you'll yeah, it's a penis. Who is the guy talking? That's the main character. The first thing you found when you googled me was some guy saying that my video on everything wrong with a DMC4 is bad? Eh. To each their own. Maybe he, maybe to him it was the worst thing he'd ever come across. I accompany you to Mount Baromises. I had hoped you'd say yes. I'm glad. My heart is not set. I still have questions. I hope to find answers along the way. I had other reason to invite you. There is someone I'd like you to meet waiting on Baromises. Who is that? An enemy, and an ally also. You will just have to wait. Th that makes no yourself. sense. An enemy and an ally. He's an anti-hero already. That Larsa likes his secrets. <sighs> he does not mean ill by it. He's not bad. At least for an Imperial. Yeah, usually the people who d dislike my stuff don't really understand that I'm just there to entertain them, not make a serious critique of something. Even though I do mention actual points that I, you know, you'll, are there, I'm just there to make people laugh. Holy Mount Burrow, me say I wonder if anyone's ever counted how many ash shots there are of your f Once bunny girl. We, act, we need not fear pursuit by their airships. Don't get your hopes up. You remember the Leviathan sailed straight over the Yacht Yenser, right up to Rathal's tomb. Skystone that works even in Yacht. You know, nether sites behind it. Little wonder they're so keen on the stuff. And what is it you're after, Balthier? You're a welcome hand and a great aid, but why? Worried I'm out to steal the nether site, eh? Can't say I'm unaccustomed to people doubting my intentions. Nothing could be further from my mind. Shall I swear by your sword or some such? Apologies, but I needed to. You think he leaves that shirt unbuttoned just to show his abs off? Depends on you. He's got, he has you to, right? To have yeah, I'm packed. I know it. I'm only here to see how the story unfolds. Any it's also like the, the way that his is vest him. is designed. It looks like he's wearing a door. Larsa joins a party as a guest. At least she's not 15. That's a plus. You're bored of all these blondes? Yeah, this cast could really just be you know, the Aryan RPG, couldn't they? War Chief Supine Lu, so we will leave. He's 15 in bunny years, okay. I'll um, I'll trust your math. His shirt is too small for him. Every person in this game looks like they put on clothes for a child. It's just like none of it fits. <clears throat> Take this as a token of our parting. Take a killer bow and a quiver of onion arrows. I already had a killer bow though. 
you would li if you would ride a chocobo, you may. I have spoken with the Moogle. She will not charge you for your first use of the chocobo. Take care of the road ahead. Should it lead back to our land, you are welcome guests. Spirits of the land watch over you. At least when Siri from which earlier left her cleavage visible, it was because she didn't want people to see the scar on her face. Is that really the, the reason? Look at my boobs, not my face? I mean, I can understand the logic. I was told there'd be a free chocobo. You're right, free. The others, the offer is only good once, though. I think I know where this is going. I, mean, I think I came across the tracks earlier that actually, you know, that only a chocobo can get across. Siri says that in Witcher 3, if you start Hearts of Stone DLC before finishing the main game. Oh, it's a weird activation for a line. Sup, I, I'm a, I can now, I can chill with my homies, the chocobos. Is this like a getting the inward pass for a chocobo, by the way? I'm just curious. No, my uh, figures. Is there a reason we need a chocobo to pass through knee high grass? Only a chocobo can pass such a terrain. Yep, check a few sources. Many people seem to agree that Vaughn is one of the best in Dissidia. Really? I guess they, that's how they made up for it. not invited to the chocobo cookout either. Damn it. I want some good barbecue. Wait, wait. Are they cooking themselves at the barbecue? These mines are sovereign territory of the Arcadian Empire. If you know business here, kindly take your leave. Is that not where I was supposed to go? Shit. Uh-oh. Where not every game you've ever played has been sinned by me. Hmm. That's how you start developing mental illness. Schizophrenia. I'm like, oh, I'm being watched and followed. So... Okay, it's in Eastern Kirwan, so it's that way. I'm gonna make our... I'm gonna get back quickly. Activate speed! I've only got 74 seconds. <coughs> Poor Vaughn ignored in his own game, rightfully so, I would, I would mention. He doesn't do anything to be noticed, he just stands around, lets everyone, like, do everything else. Tofu is the same texture and, you know, consistency of your brain, you guess, people who... Eating tofu, know what human brain... How do you... How, where have you heard this data at? I guess this one was a success. Wow, I'm impressed, Bon. I got a good feeling. An alliance between way. Dalmasca and the Empire. Reason tells me tis the only course. We must avoid a wasting war with the Empire at all cost. Yet I fear I could not bear the shame. Had I put the strength? A shame, perhaps, for me and for you. They do a Prince of Persia trilogy is when you start dropping subs and bits. And you can just accept this, can you? 
Oh. I wouldn't do it for that reason. I'd do it because I'd want to play it. <clears throat> you can't bribe me. Did I forget my nightly vows? If I could protect but one person from war's horror, then I would I'm incorruptible. I would bear it proudly. I could not defend my home. What is shame to me? My people hate the Empire. They will not accept this. There is hope. All right. Don't encourage. Hope for a future where we can join hands I as brothers. Feeling. <laughs> Larson, please. Only this if they're serious. cute oh, children, though. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry. Don't be Larsa. Somebody's got to put him in his place. Have I ever tried Danganronpa? No. Intrigue, but Lord Vane is not one to be brought down easily. The entire military waits upon his orders, from the War Council down to the rank and file. What better blade than he to strike down the enemies of the Empire? Your Honor reminds me of Zet two years. Have any of you ever like dressed up as those guys in Dark Souls? Seems doable. And what became of him? Gone without a trace since Napoleon. I will not hear you malign Judge Sect. He was a noble warrior. Or do you think his trust in Lord Vane ill-placed? Vane took two of his own brother's lives. He is ruthless beyond contempt. Ruthless, you say? Would he were more so? He gives traitors no quarter, be they of his own blood. Can they get hot in those? How fitting for one who would bear the burden. But could we bear him? Zargabath, what of you? Surely you do not believe his brothers were traitors? So found his excellency, Lord Gramis. You would do well to mind your tongue, Drace. That matter is long past. Your honors, a summons. Lord Vane has arrived at the palace. We come at once. Lord Larsa has left for Boromises. He hopes to enlist the aid of the Grand Cutius in stopping the insurgents. I doubt this will be enough to deter Ondor, but even a slight hindrance to his operations would be welcome. This will delay the Rosarian invasion, and we will have bought much needed time to shore up our defenses. Just as His Excellency had hoped. No matter the result, I'm pleased with the young lord's Jesus, progress. this is just like watching but Phantom Menace stop. The faces of those mud-witted senators. The fools think a child emperor. They just walk and talk. Walk and talk. Why are you walking and talking? They're just walking and talking. Yes, Here's another scene where I walk and talk. I, I'm just imagining Red Letter Media's Mr. Plinker review right now. How the Senate fears and despises Lord Vane's ability? When they realize the truth, that Lord Lhasa is no docile lamb to be shepherded, they will bare their teeth and devour him. You are right. I shall speak on this matter with His Excellency at once. Abranth. Chad, how can you tell if she's thick? It's all metal. Lord Lhasa. Jesus Christ, Chad. It's a suit of armor. Aye. They're all thick because it's just you know, several extra hundred pounds. Where's, the, where's there a dude? They're dead. I get it. We need to dismount. Oh, thank you, my new healer character. You just know, do you? Uh-oh. I, th I think he's broken. He's trying to get rid of the silence on Bosch, which is permanent because of the item. Stop it, boy. Oh, well. It's cute that he keeps trying.
No, I'm going to have to change his gambit. He's probably got a gambit on to remove silence. Uh, poison Vox, yeah, that. Uh, Alex. Bubble. Double max HP of one ally. Uh, sure. Who that? What are my levels at? So Ash is at 16, Botch 17. Okay, I think we need to get Pinello to... 16, no. Good. All right. You done? Eat, eat. Bubbles. What are you? This is what happens when you let the player program the AI. Well, that's pretty good. He gave me a bunch of extra max HP. Not too shabby. Gormor jungle. Every single fantasy word in this game. Feels like something I gotta you know, cough out of my throat. Kill the tentacle brain dog. Oh, I like that brain dog. Squid dog, actually, I think is the better word for it. What messes with your tongue? Apricots? What's that fruit that changes the way you taste fruit? Food? I think it's an apricot, right? What was the best spoiler you ever got for a game, a movie, and a show? Well, I don't know. I, I mean, I, I found out that Snape kills Dumbledore for a book once. I think that's probably the most legendary spoiler. And that was literally a meme. Keep casting that bubble boy. Actually, no, stop. That's actually a really expensive spell. You're not going to be able to heal me anymore. I'll take that off him. Just turn this one off, actually, for now. All right. Uh, so let's continue. I think we have enough time to finish this dungeon up tonight. Can you change the condition of the gambits? There's a lot of stuff you can do with the gambits, but I despise using them. I, I, oh, baby Marlboro. What, why are the Marlboro so tiny? They're usually like gigantic hulking monsters that just fuck you up. Are you curious? It looks like in Decidia's Lightning is, being bought, is a bottom tier character. Good. Maybe, maybe use some magic. Didn't I buy Fyra? I guess I haven't unlocked the license for it yet, but I should have. Oh, there it is. Oh, hit him with the Fyra.
You died so many times against these babies? You mean the... in this game? They're not real pushovers, but they're not the marbles you're used to. Let's look at the map. Yep, it's gigantic. I guess we're going over that way. I think that's like some kind of hunting ground or something. be best Kingdom Hearts magic. Why? Because he just yells out THUNDER every time you use it. Kingdom Hearts 1 will always be the best Kingdom Hearts game. Change my mind. That's how that meme works. Okay, uh, they just put protective on everyone, so that means magic. Up on the gargoyles business. Realize that Larsa is all out of MP, so I should probably throw any uh, either on him. Maybe he can start healing me. The big Marlboros are hunt exclusives, I figured. Yeah, the baby ones don't aren't that big of a threat. They're just you know, kind of annoying. The gargoyle was a tougher, actually. Oof, tough fight, though. Larsa does not have much MP. He is just running through it. Why does Larsa remind you of Salazar from Resident Evil 4, but not, I don't know, he's a tiny little boy who has an English accent. Whereas, yo, know, Salazar was none of that. Uh, you know what, look, we kind of need the XP, we're leveling right now. Mobilize them, please. And you missed all of them. Good. Hey, see you later, I guy. You have a good night. Yeah, I know, I know you're talking about the Spanish guy, right? But he doesn't really remind me of that either. Otherwise, he'd be telling, like, yo, Ash, there, I see the king equipped his daughter with ballistics. Or in this case, games, I see the, the, the king equipped his daughter with methicide. What do you think that character will be like in the remake? If that actually still ends up happening. That line got. That line, that line has to reoccur, right? It's too cheesy and creepy to not be in there. over there. Kind of like Hojo's cross Bria. That, 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 that works though because Hojo's a piece of shit though. What? What are you? At least it's friendly. I don't know if I want to fight something that looks that messed up though. What 
is it? The jungle denies us our passage. What have we done? We? No. I. What's that mean? How are we supposed to get through that? Making an appearance. Come on, I'm um, talking over here. I thought you'd They're ignoring Vaughn just like they should. Our choices are few. Friend? Both here. This is as much for you uh, as it is me. Oh. You are ill at ease. The Nethersite troubles you. You've let your eyes betray your heart. Right. What are you doing? <sighs> Soon you will learn. We go to seek aid of the Viera who dwell ahead. I bet they'll be glad to see you after so long. I am unwelcome, an unsought guest in their wood. Pledge your life debt to a human. Ooh, I, I just realized one of my characters be silenced. This upcoming scene, I do remember it. I just know there's a bunch of bunny girls. Now that you mention it, she is a bit like Kimari, isn't she? In the village ahead, you will find her, Nyan. Bring Nyan. her to me. She will know why you call her. Upa, where have I seen you before? No matter, I know where you've come. I've just a thing to help you get to the bottom of all those Viera secrets. Would you like to buy a map? Okay, Tingle, thank you. The Moogles are, yeah, the Moogles are super cute. Cutest they've ever been, actually. Mainly because they give them outfits. And they actually made them look more like actual animals, instead of just like, fairy creature. Oop, I thought you looked familiar. You were the one who helped us on the Leviathan. We've had quite a time reaching this village. Oh, I hope you don't think we've followed you. Here, Kubo. That wouldn't do at all. Well, would you like to see my wares? You won't find any shops around here, Kubo. Best stock up all you can. Mm, oh, you got, you got new stuff. Ooh, new spells. Like Thundara. Hmm. Uh... Do I have anything to sell? During these times of crisis, can you be a symbol of peace and justice? No. I tell dick jokes online. And I'm proud of that. Beetle guys. Uh, I got good stuff, but I can't buy it. Everything is so goddamn expensive. Asuna, I've heard, is really good. Removes harmful status effects from one ally. Hmm. I'm conflicted. Asuna or Thundara? Yawns intensely. I'm sorry. Hot take, the FF7R koala moogles are so fucking cute that you can't change your mind. You like what you like. The only moogle in FF7 Remake, though, was you know, the kid dressed as one. Mm. 
We should have enough money soon to buy then yo Asuna. I might have to do some grinding off screen for this game. Did I not get the Chocobo and Moogle summon in this game? I have Oh, oh yeah, you oh never mind, yeah, you did there that you do get that summon in the game. I completely forgot about that. I didn't I think I only used it like once though. I used Fat Chocobo more than I did that one. A root village. Yes, they live in trees, just so in case you were, you'll maybe had forgotten that they're basically Chewbacca. They, they live in the treetops. We know. That chocobo made you feel things. Tell us about these feelings. You are unwelcome in the wood. She will not suffer humans to walk her burden paths. Fairy denies you. Leave now, wash you may. Flash in the ass everywhere, huh? Is this Kashyyyk? Uh, it's sexy Kashyyyk. You're not gonna get turned on by a Wookiee unless you got a strange fetish, but here you don't have to feel weird about it. Walk a hidden enclave of the Vera known to Outlanders as Irud Village, who wish no co consort with others. Libos. I have no words to speak to a human. They also kind of remind me of the Guado a little bit. With the long arms and stuff, with you know, long arms and long fingers. Yeah, you know, they're like sexy guado a little bit too. Is it because the spring remains apart, the flowers bloom? Who would not understand? Our laws forbid, forfend, whatever that means. I guess forbid is the same thing. The outside world. Here, silence and solitude will be our companions. Everyone looks stoned and like walking around aimlessly. Sunward path leads to the fane of our elder, Jote. Though I cannot think she would speak with a hue. Still a lot of racist vibes. That stop. Jotun, uh, whatever, however it's pronounced. I'm not good at fantasy English. This leads over here. Let's check that out real quick. This path leads to the cove of the wood warders. You will find not there for a hume. Hell, yeah, well, all these chicks talking about my wood. Damn, Beavis. <laughs> talking about my wood. Sorry, I'm, I'm just wretched that sage of the night. What errand have you with Mjern? What errands could you have? Should leave before aught it'll come to the pass for your sake and our own. Mirn, her visage darkly clouded, child of many gifts and such promise that she cannot bring her fierce spirit to heal. Ever do the storm clouds follow her. Why? This is clearly swipping Germanic beliefs now? What? Uh, I'll take your word on that. Swiping. No, you know, I read that wrong. The sunward path leads to the fane of our elder. Oh, no. You can't spell? No, I can't either. Fane of the village elder. You know, I didn't know the fane of the village elder. Gotcha. 
This this game developer really likes circular levels, doesn't he? So there's been so many maps are just here's a bunch of circles. Her, doesn't she? We're here to see her. <sighs> you will leave at once. It is not allowed for humans to walk on these grounds. We'll go as soon as we've seen Mjern. If you can find her. We're not leaving until you let us see her. Oh, look at this kid growing some balls. Acting like a main character. Fine then. We'll look for her ourselves. Ah. I've heard the voice of the wood. She says Mjern is not in the village. Kyote, where has she gone? Why do you ask? The wood tells us where she has gone. Or can you not hear her? You cannot. Your ears are dull from hearing their harsh speech, I think. Viera, who have abandoned the wood, are Viera no longer. Mjörn, too, has left her embrace. And you forsake them in turn? It is the will of the village. Viera must live always with the wood. So is the green word, and so is our law. We'll let you worry about keeping your laws. Just do us a favor and stay out of our way. We'll find her ourselves. How do they reproduce? A no good question. They don't seem to have males. They're like the, the Garf. They're just like one sex. They reproduce with the Garf? That can't be true. They do have males, but I guess they just keep them locked up. Our sister has left the wood and gone west. She wanders warrens among men who hide themselves in clothes of cold iron. Thus to me has the wood spoken. The Viera may begin as part of the wood, but the wood is not the only end we may choose. The same words I heard 50 years ago. Vera keep the females and the Garif keep the males. Okay, the Garif are the male bunny rabbit people then. I guess that's why their ears were so big. So do they like have like a party they go to every once in a, every once in a while just like, hey, mating time. Otherwise it's gonna be difficult. Oh, you're just kidding? Okay. I was actually taking you seriously. Cause I it would have made some sense. Stop it, Dex. Stop scratching my arm! Bunny or well, there are rabbits. Give Dex attention. I'm playing video games right now. You get my attention. Dex got enough already today. Shed all over me too. Just Google it. Vera breed with other races, but those pairings only produce more Vera and not the other races. That is a weird quirk of evolution. How does that happen? I don't see how that evolution would ever d deign that to be useful. They're like the Asari, pretty much. They came up with the idea of the Asari before Mass Effect. Only yelled bunny girls. Yeah, very dominant genes. So what if they met mate with one of those lizard people we've seen throughout the game? Hmm. 
Guess it works. What if they mate with a Moogle? I mean, not, not, there's just uh, that's a huge can of worms we didn't need open. Not bad, Vaughn. Didn't think we'd get any information out of that one. An Icelandic so accent. Then, what was she saying about men in a warren? The Hennemagicite mines. Maybe that's what she meant. They lie in Bangor, south of the Osmoan Plain. The entire region is a colony of the Arcadian Empire. There would be soldiers. Is that a problem? Let's move. Fran. Yes? I was wondering what Yote said, you know? About how you said the same thing 50 years ago? Your point? Uh, how old were you again? Uh, nice fun. Oh, surprisingly rude. Try to grow up, please. It's actually an honest question. Not like it matters to, to the bunny girl, they live hundreds of years. <clears throat> Why would it be culturally sensitive? But avoid unnecessary confrontation. Do what you must and let us be off. When you are ready, we should return to Osmoan Plain in the west. Hine Mines are the only a short distance south. Hmm. Okay, chat. I think we're going to end it a little bit early tonight. Well, 30 minutes early. Just because i got a little bit of work left to do on the video. So... I'm hoping to, you know, to have that out for you tomorrow, so I'd like to... As long as Rune sends the intro anyways. But I uh, still gotta figure out what I'm gonna put it up for the vote, and also just watch through it and make sure it's all working. So I'm gonna stop here for the night. But you guys have been great tonight. Thank you guys for showing up. Much appreciated. Uh, I'll definitely be streaming again tomorrow, so if you want to stop by and say hi, I'd appreciate that as well. If you haven't followed me out here on Twitch, consider hitting that follow button. And if you want to join my Discord, you can find the link to that down below. Anyways, thank you for any bits, any subs or gift subs, and yes, thank you for the patronage. Thank you guys for being chill, and thanks to my mods as well, as always. Chat, hope I was at least chuckle-worthy tonight. M maybe I was in the first couple hours, but after the game set in, got a little like, uh... Alright, <clears throat> I'm gonna call it a night. Well, not yet, I got some work to do. But you guys, you can call it a night, go to work, whatever it is for you, and I hope to see you tomorrow. Later, everyone!